Hi everyone, I'm Lynette Dolan from sunscience.org and today I'm going to be talking about how to balance your root chakra, Muladhara. Your root chakra, Muladhara, is your basic most fundamental chakra. What should you do when it gets out of control? The experts from sunscience.org will show you how to fix it. Subscribe to our channel for regular updates. Please like and share this with your friends and leave us your comments. Visit sunscience.org today for some really cool stuff. If you've opened your root chakra, congratulations. You felt that sudden new pulsing of spiritual energy that begins to course through your veins. You feel your willpower being boosted by the knowledge that you are a concrete being, your own self, and nobody else is you. But then, maybe you start feeling tired again, start feeling like you are being drawn into the current of the world again, like you're starting to drift back into the flow of how everyone else lives, without identity. You feel like you're beginning to simply be a passive existence again, which means your root chakra is unbalanced. Sunsigns.org says that the root chakra is the chakra you should meditate on the most. It's the gateway to your other chakras and without a strong root chakra balance, the rest of your chakras come crashing down all at once. You simply cannot maintain a tower if the base of the tower is crumbled or weak. So, let's now talk about the meditation for root chakra healing from sunsigns.org. But before that, find out if your root chakra is really unbalanced with the free chakra quiz on sunsigns.org. Now, let's take a look at the meditation for balancing your root chakra. This is a meditation that monks in China and Tibet use in a different form. They understand the body's energy as qi and not chakra energy, but their basis is the same. Connect with the ground. Stand on the solid ground somewhere. Upper floors of buildings will not work. It's best if you can stand outside in nature, but the ground floor of a house will do. Put your feet shoulder width apart and turn your toes in just ever so slightly. Bend your knees a couple of degrees and breathe in deeply through your nose. Screw your feet into the floor so that your connection with the ground gets stronger. This is a strong stance. As you draw in your breath, make a circle with the index finger and thumb of each hand and extend the other fingers fully. Scoop up with both hands on the inward breath as though you're picking up a pile of feathers. On the outward breath, turn your hands over and let them sink downward as your body sinks slightly further down as well. Bend your knees a few more degrees, but do not move your feet. When you breathe in, tighten the muscles between your anus and your genitals as this stimulates the root chakra. When you breathe out, relax them fully as you sink downward. Your feet may begin to feel hot. That's good. Every breath you take draws in more energy from the earth into your root chakra and it draws it up through your legs. Make sure that you sink with each breath just a little bit. When you've reached your limit for how low you can sink, then keep that position for 25 more breaths. To finish the meditation, sunsigns.org suggests that you take one final deep breath and let your knees straighten back out. Let the circles from your fingers go and shake your hands and legs out. Make sure to rehydrate yourself after you do this root chakra meditation because it may make you perspire due to its intensity. Please like and share this video. Check out the description below for more info. Click below to subscribe for latest updates and for more interesting videos. And follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Don't forget to share your experiences in the comment section.